Hello, friends. It is I, Mr. Miola. And today, we're going to be fighting this guy. I don't know much about it. It's a green dragon. Its name is the mini ninja boss. And it is a god. Um, and he's not too happy with me. This guy spawned in yesterday when I killed a mystical wyvern who then summoned in a manticore, who then summoned in another manticore, and then summoned in this guy. Um... And I think we might be able to kill this and make it the first or second god boss that we have ever killed. So cross your fingers and, and pray for me because I'm going to need all the help I can get here. Also, there's a weird windstorm going on and I, I, don't know, I don't know what's causing that. But I'm not going to waste any time because I don't really know how long this is going to take. Um, so <laughs> let's get into this thing and see what we can do to it. Eternal heart jug bug just spawned. Oh, that's nice. I don't need eternal hearts though. I was kind of trying to see what we could do as far as range goes against this guy, but I doubt we're going to be able to burn him to a crisp. So I think this is going to be a melee fight. I'm going to chill up on this rock and we're just going to pummel down at it. Um, we actually do pretty good damage. Uh, I, I've been I've, I've been talking dirty on this man to call ever since we got it yesterday as we evolved it up from its dodo wyvern and before that was a wyvern and before that was a dragon. It, it, it's come up from, I think, a pegamastax. I think this thing began at. Um, but long story short, this is the best I've had against a god creature yet. We might only be dealing a million damage, which is nowhere near as good as our space panda buffed builds. Um, but what it can do... It's just tank hits. We have half a billion health of our own. I have more health than this god. Uh, so I can just really sit here and just, just bite it, basically. <laughs> That's all there is to it. Um, in fact, I'm really big. Like, I'm much bigger than this thing. What do I want out of this? I have no clue. I don't know what I can get out of this. I don't know what he's going to give me for killing him. I hope he's going to thank me for his time and reward me with something really, really nice. I really hope that that would be amazing. That would be really, really cool. I have no clue. I didn't even know this thing existed until it spawned right before my eyes. So, uh, yeah, I unfortunately need to hit this guy 470, roughly 470 times. Like, like five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna, it's gonna be a while. So, um, I am going to sit back, get comfy in my seat here, and I'm just gonna keep on swiping at the thing. And um, unless something crazy goes down between now and getting this guy to pretty low, I think it's going to be a pretty uneventful five to ten minutes. So leave me to it, and I'll catch up with you guys once I've got this guy on the ropes, or maybe he's got me on the ropes. I don't see it happening, but we will see. Crazier things have happened. Yo, something's happened. He's taking flight. Um, I, I don't know. I, yeah, cool. <laughs> um, you please don't leave me. Where do you think you're going? He's also dealing a lot more damage. It's kind of like he's entered like a phase two of this fight or something. Uh, but long story short, I'm still here clicking away. As you can see, it's a mess. Um, the, the, the windstorm has stopped, so that's quite nice. But yeah, we're just uh, still grinding away. He's down to 175 million and he's flying now. Phase two of the fight, I guess. I don't know. All right. We've got him down to 38 million health now. So he's close. Unfortunately, he's been a little bit of a pain in the backside, though, and he's decided to start flying around, which is a little different and a little just, I don't know, he's trying to mix things up a little bit, add different elements to the fight. But, buddy, just sit down and take it. It's over, mate. I've got you 95% of the way down on health. There's no point trying to fight back now. What you should be doing is thinking about what you're going to reward me with when I do deliver these last 25 million damage to you. You're going to give me a little, a little, oh, give me like a spawn of a tameable version. Give me a tameable version to accept like a stronger one because you've been really disappointing in this fight and I've absolutely wiped the floor with you, my little green ninja. So just, um, yeah, let's do that, eh? Let's just, let's do that. Two more hits. Spawn in a spawnable version for me and I'll uh, be very grateful. Be very, very grateful. <laughs> Where did he go? Still here? Don't tell me he despawned. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. No, he's still here. I'm taking damage. Oh, where did he go? Hold on. No. No. No, something is... Something is attacking me. I'm grounded right this second. Hold on, there's something... Has he gone invisible? What in the world is happening? Hold on a second. Wait, no, of course he's still here. Because, but where is he? he? He, he's definitely here. I'm looking at him. His health is on my screen. His health bar, it was on my screen. Now it's gone. Hold on, where is he? I'm taking damage from him still. 
Where is he? Where is he? He's gone somewhere. <laughs> He's invisible. He's got 8.8 .8 million health. You can't do this to me, dude. I'm taking so much damage right this second. Where are you? Doesn't look like he's on the ground. Oh, no. No, no, no. You tell me I can't ride you underwater, dude? Yeah, I have no idea what's happened, but um, now the damage has stopped. Well, not the damage, but all the buffs and stuff that we were taking. He despawned. He despawned. I just spent like 15 minutes. My hand is about to fall off. 15 minutes tapping away on that little green dude. And he disappears on me. Are you kidding me? That sucks. So, a little time has passed since the first little part of this episode. In fact, an entire weekend has passed. And once again, I did shut down the server. So, I was a little nervous uh, jumping into the world today. But thankfully, everything seems to be okay. Including, have a look at this. Uh, I guess my friends over here have been generating up a storm. Because look at all my heads and artifacts, as a matter of fact, too. Uh. Um, yeah, this is really cool. I don't really have any use for six Rockwell heads, uh, trophies. They're all... Oh, no, we got beta, alpha, gamma. We got the lot. Um, cool. Neither nor do I have use for motor heads. And this one's got even more in it for some reason. We got Titan heads. We got the lot. Do we have any... Do we have any King Titan? Or just Desert? Oh, oh no, that's motor. Uh, King Titan, gamma? beta there's actually things we can do with these that i've like never really crafted because not many maps have these things also the empowerment station all right i gotta get on that i completely forgot that thing exists and i think it'll actually help us out um so what am i looking for i know that there's some items oh also the ascenders unlocks the ascension items apparently these ascenders give us extra levels and stuff i think this stuff here this is what i was looking for so uh we've got the repair station not that one the tech stove this one uses a gamma i've never been able to get the tech stove or maybe i have i can't remember either ways now i can we can cook meat <laughs> the forge it uses oh my goodness i can actually craft this stuff i'm actually going to it's gonna cost a lot because like this, for example, requires 64 industrial forges. Um, yeah, 100%. Oh, we can finally get the S plus tech set. I've never had it before. I'm, I'm actually pumped about that. But first things first, I do want to get this because I just forgot this completely existed. The empowerment station. I have no idea what this is, but I'm pretty sure I can afford it. I don't even know where to... I was going to say, I don't know where to craft it. Craft it on my own body. Bam. We got everything we need. Bam. Let's craft it up. So this here, um, I... I I don't know. I don't know what it does. Let's place it down and find out together, I suppose. Let's just chuck it over here. This here. I should have read the, the thing. Activate buffs. What do you mean? Let me read the little description very quickly. It provides the base upon which you can equip an empowerment artifact. So an empowerment artifact are these things. We've unlocked a level one and a level two. Um. Oh, this is tough. Yeah, I remember fine. I remember when we unlocked these and we realized how expensive they are. Can only be crafted in an empowerment station. So let's have a look, shall we? Oh, there's three of them in here. One, two, and... Oh, we do have the third one unlocked. But we need primordial Hereford essence. I've never even seen that before. We also need 450 Indominus tokens. Let's just start with level one for the time being, hey? Summoning reagents. That's all I need. I don't even need that many of them. I can make that happen so quick. How about level two? Uh, a lot more. More silver carrots. I can't even remember where we got the ones that we've got. And Indominus tokens, which that's actually not that hard to gather. Um, I can't remember where we get silver carrots from, though. But either ways, let's just get a level one. Don't even worry about level three. Uh, I need summoning reagents. Okay, 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 okay. That's actually not going to be that bad because all I need to do is kill a rhino. That's all I got to do. One rhino. What if I want two sets? Just kill two rhinos. Three. Kill three rhinos. Four. Okay, and then a wyvern and a rhino. Um, okay, we're good. All I gotta do, do is kill a hard mode rhino, which is gonna take three seconds because I'm an absolute beast. Uh, uh, mystical, the rhino boss, where are your mates? There you are. Legit, kill this guy and we're good. We're golden. So I'll just grab this stuff and we're gonna make it happen. <laughs> this is amazing. This is so good. Oh, also, I recloned Spaced Panda. We got a 1.9x, which is fantastic. Um, but I don't know if we'll be using him. I am going to bust out big old Manticore. Who, by the way, um, not to do with the Manticore as such, but I did just double check everything that we need in case I do want to go for the Wicked Manticore soon. And it turns out... Oh, and this guy here still exists, by the way. So it's kind of an out-of-bounds area for the time being. Um... 
Also, where is my boss border? Because I don't know where I've left it. Um, what was I saying, though? We are 10 boss essence away from evolving our Dodo Wyvern up to the Wicked Manticore. One one kill. That's all I got to do. I got to kill one Dark Star. We'll even get some essence from this. In fact, this might even give us the ticket that we need to get there. Uh, if I could find my, my spawner. Where's the last place I used that big blue boss spawner? I remember flying around the map looking for looking for things looking for insects to spawn it alongside but i can't remember where i put it dang it i've actually lost the thing all right let me go craft a freshie i'm still just completely shocked at the size of our manticore it's it's just ridiculous it's insane it's so silly uh okay so hard i'm just gonna grab two of them just in case who knows um oh and by the way i think the hierophant essence that that thing there required is this i think it's talking about this here are the god mode bosses and we've killed a couple gods there's the kraken we've seen the kraken we haven't killed it but we've seen it there was the um tempest from the pugnacia mod we killed that we also saw the green dragon that was another god none of them are the gods spawnable in here there's a god mode bionic magma saw which sounds terrifying because the hard mode sucks and then you've got a dark hierophant summon and then you've got the resurrected golem god now i don't know if that is the bacon dude but it might be the the, the big old thing that killed space panda the other day and just wreaked havoc to, on us maybe i don't know i'm not too certain um but it might be it might be also i'm looking for a resurrection stone right now and i don't know what i've done with them resurrection stone just in case i need it there's my hard mode summoners let's go and i'm in such just a mood to get this done I'm doing it right outside the base, baby. So, fingers crossed this doesn't spawn anything. I, I, I'm stuck on my manticore. This is not the rush that I was looking for. I much was stuck. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, ugly, ugly. Just, 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 just jetpack me up. Fine. You know what? There. There. Okay, you get scooped up. That's what you get for being a bane. A thorn in my backside. Take that. Take that. Take that. Take that. I don't even know what I need to summon this thing because I feel like it's been a while since I've done it. Mystical Rhino coming right up. I placed all the correct items in there too. Uh, and now it's just a matter of finding out whether or not I want to fight this with... Also, what's down here real quick? Nothing of use. If I fight this with my Manticore or if I fight this with uh, my new Spaced Panda? I kind of want to use my Spaced Panda because I know that it'll annihilate it in like three seconds. Um, but... Old man's call mate here. He's pretty. He's pretty cool too. He's a. He's a pretty cool dude. And he's our like fresh guy. He's, he's new. He's exhilarating. He's exciting. You just. You need to use him, right? <laughs> if things go pear shaped, I'll change my plans. But I'm pretty sure. I'm. I'm. I'm trying to. F oh, he's grounding me. You big potato. I'm not even hitting him either. All right. Can we? Can I hit him with something a little bit more exciting? Right. Yeah. Maybe spare spender was the answer here. I'm just trying to keep my distance without aggravating big old bacon overlord golem god over there. Because uh, I just wanted to sit up here and do a bit of this action. Just wanted to shoot some little shoot some little orbs down. Because I'm pretty sure... Wait, I'm pretty sure... Wait, really? Wait, what? I'm not even damaging him. <laughs> Wait, what? Really? What do you mean? What do you mean? Hey, there we go. All right, we're hitting him now. Um, maybe I'm just really inaccurate. Maybe that... Yeah, I actually am like missing him by a mile. Let me just curve it over here. And I didn't want to get too close to him. Now I've been grounded. Not ideal. All right. We're definitely going to bust out old Space Panda then. Manticore, mate. You got to sit this one out. I'm just creating work for myself here. Don't mind me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm down here. I'm down here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Go, go, go. No, go, go, go. I'm stuck under the wing of my Manticore. Okay. Thankfully, I haven't popped a hit. Okay, we're good. All right, nice. Nice. Uh, let me quickly get an insect. How am I making such a mess of such, <laughs> such an easy boss? Legit. And my guy over here is just doing his thing because he's a machine like that. 10 million damage. Have we been nerfed? I thought we were... Oh, no, it's a hard mode boss. Never mind. We haven't been nerfed. I'm hoping this empowerment thing gives us some powers to, I don't know, do cool and exciting, powerful things. I, I don't know. Maybe it, maybe it gives us a massive power boost or something. And that would be pretty sweet if it does. But there's only one way to find out. 
That's by killing this rhino. He's going to give me three essence, which is going to get me 36 summoning reagents. I'm just trying to remember the name of everything. And is easily going to get us everything that we need. So that is toasted. I didn't even check if... Oh my goodness. Oh, 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 oh I should not have dismounted just then. I didn't even check if anything piggyback spawned, and you better did. We got an Ursa Major hard mode right here. Uh, my very negligent butt nearly just got annihilated by this thing, and I'm shocked that it didn't. So, let's just quickly... Hey, Manticore, you can help me out too, mate. You can help out in this one here. If you're good for health. Are you good? <gasps> Dude, my guy's getting annihilated. Hold on a second. Um. All right. Oh, my goodness. He was like really low on health that's that's scary um yeah i gotta pay more attention if that man could died i probably would have cried but i'm pretty sure it's got a resurrection stone on it so it would have been it would have been fine it would have respawned i think i don't know i should probably double check that before i go sacrifice him to some random little boss that means absolutely nothing to me all right that's ursa major deaded and it looks like nothing else has spawned good all right fantastic let's go let's go get this empowerment thing and see what it means see what it means for us power boost fingers crossed on the power boost i want like a triple quadruple mega damage i just want to 5x everything just just give me that power boost or something i don't really care just just make it make something nice um i don't need any of this cool let's hop on down here i'll give you the essence and in return, I would like three sets of these. What do these require? What am I spending? Nothing. Just metal. Easy. So it's going to give me 36 more. <laughs> we got 55 of them now. Fantastic. Um, great. Fantastic. Oh, I've got nine boss essence. I need one more. I need... That's all I need. One more. Also, is there a meteor strike going on down there? There is. There is. I could tell. Shadows over here just get nuts for some reason. Whenever that decides to happen. Also, I, I, I'm not trying to leave my base right this second. So if we could just stay inside of it and stop throwing our fists around, that would be lovely. But let's do this thing. So I, how short am I again on the on the, on the the super one? Summoning reagents. I could nearly do it. Indominus tokens. All right, let's just start with a level one. Let's just do that, okay? Um, I guess I just double tap this. I take my leftovers. We sit here and we... We wait a second and we've got a level one empowerment artifact and then i just activate buffs is this oh please i hope this doesn't i hope this isn't like a timed exclusive and then it just runs out over time surely not it's super expensive let's go three two one go okay that didn't work i did activate buffs nothing happened um again okay okay i don't understand what's happening but sure unless i need to Hold it. No, I can't even extract it. Equip. <gasps> oh, okay. There we go. Aha. It's actually in the pedestal now. Okay, okay. Here we go. Three, two, one. Bam. Okay. There's a little thing down the bottom right-hand side of the screen with a number one. That's all, that's all I know so far. And it says a 5% stat increase. Okay. And I assume I get that anywhere? Okay, so I wonder what the level two means. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to find out. I reckon it'll be like a 10% stat increase, but 5% is decent. It's like, it's nothing crazy, but I guess we should go test it out, right? I don't know if that applies to Tames or just me, but that's pretty cool regardless. Okay, I'll take it. That's a win. That's a, that, that's that's 100% a, a win, um, especially because I need... To just go kill one more dark mode boss or hard mode boss sorry and i'm gonna go and do that right this second what do i need to fight these guys it's expensive mystical bosses are definitely cheaper i'm gonna do a wyvern um because i i need to i need i need i need the re i need the the essence from the wyvern to get more summoning reagents which we will end up needing um but oh, now that i know that this now that i've remembered that the empowerment thing is a thing I'm going to strive. I'm going to strive for like level two of it. I can't believe I forgot that it even exists. All right. Let's get that wyvern on the way. I'm going to kick its butt. We're going to get the last few little pieces of essence that we need. And then it's time to get us the wicked magic or at last. I did not 
I didn't I didn't think I was gonna do this today I guess I, <laughs> I didn't realize how little essence we actually needed this is great all right insect come here you are nothing but my little damage booster 53 million damage what do we normally do exactly because I don't recall <laughs> 90 million damage excuse me okay all right come on show me hard mode more than 10 million more than 10 million uh 11 million okay so we got about a, a hundred thousand uh, sorry we got about a 500,000 to a million damage buff and yes it does apply to my dinosaur because he now has the buff as well so hey it gets it gets my guy here an extra million damage a hit basically that's that's decent I'll take it I'll take that's that's, that's amazing I laugh I like I love a million damage on a dinosaur and this guy just gains a million and I think that's because it's stacking his insect killer buff with the empowerment buff but all it wants me all it's made me want to do is get the level two now level level one suddenly not enough I need, <laughs> I need more power but that's sweet that's good that's gonna go a long way in fighting some of these next bosses so we've got the extra boss essence that we needed we've also got a manticore fantastic there's a ambulance or fire truck driving past my office right this second I don't know if you heard that siren but it was there let's go and kick this guy's butt as well manticore just sit right here mate just sit right here take my five million damage hits just 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 stop flying around just sit still I just want the extra little bit of essence for you because I'm sure we're gonna need it at some point just just yeah just take my hits all right now we got a bit of a rhythm going just sitting right on top of me biting down I'm absolutely unfazed to any of it he's halfway down I've got 16 seconds before my buff disappears so fingers crossed we can just get this guy done before that happens 10 seconds left probably not gonna get it done it's gonna be tight it's gonna be tight very tight here we go 36 left nah we might have like 20 ah take it close but we didn't quite get there now we're down to 2.2 million still decent don't get me wrong but um just a little bit slower in fact it's half the speed exactly half the speed that's that's legit how my buff works but goodbye old phantasmal manticore go join the rest of your friends that i've killed already and you spawned a bionic magmasaur who i'm very tempted to kill but but i'm not but 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 no i'm not going to do that i'm not going to kill that well at least the meteor shower has now disappeared and lighting in this world is back to normal now it's time to head up and go and evolve this dodo wyvern at last oh it's time to go and get this thing evolved into the manticore that wasn't the first choice last time and hopefully uh i don't know hopefully it doesn't disappoint i really really hope that whatever this thing turns into is an absolute butt kicking beast so um take this and then I don't even know what you need. That we've already got the Dark Star Man score. It's this one that we need now. So, uh, oh no! I need Indominus tokens. Wait, no, you don't need a helmet. You need. Where's my reagents? There you go. Indominus tokens? Are you kidding me? I didn't see that coming. I'll be honest. But that's fine. That's uh, that's a quick and easy fix. All I need to do is jump atop my Manticore, who nearly died not too long ago. <laughs> We gotta hit this. Oh my goodness, I'm inside of him. Uh, we're gonna go and hit the snow biome very quickly to kill some devil sheep or some Argentavises. It doesn't really matter. And um, yeah, we'll have this stuff in no time. I think I spent the tokens that I needed on the uh, empowerment thing that we ended up doing, which I guess wasn't one of the original like plans. So yeah, we ended up losing that. Whoops. But anyways, um, I guess I'm just gonna like fly around here and just just drop bombs everywhere and eventually we'll get some tokens i think or maybe i just maybe i should just run around on my on my special panda so it's worked in the past and i'm sure it'll work today aha there's a sheep fizz panda has come to wreck your face hold on we have ourselves a unique summon i don't know what fizz panda looks like though so i don't know what i'm looking for um there is some sheep down here. I can see them dropping explosions. Okay, that's tricky. I don't, I don't know what to look for, but there's something out here that we might want to tame. I don't actually know for certain. Okay, that's two tokens. I think I needed like nine more. Well, in case anyone's wondering what a fizz panda looks like, there was one right there. Uh, it is now dead. It died to uh, this Ovis, who I happen to just be about to kill. So that's kind of sad but hey at least uh at least they get to avenge the poor guy he didn't ask to be killed by the sheep 
At least I'm not the one who killed it. That makes me feel a little better. I will say it makes it so handy that these sheep just make themselves like so known so easily. They just stand out out here in the snow. It's the best. And it's not even their look. It's that they just, they keep dropping their own attacks. <gasps> Huge experience potion. Yes. I'm going to be putting that straight to use on this wicked manticore. I still don't know what these things will summon. A <gasps> That's a summoner. Okay, <laughs> I was going to drop that. Um, awesome. And I think I only need one more sheep, so let's do it. Got to love when you get all confident saying something super easy to find and they're everywhere and then you can't find a single one. That would happen. Yes, it would. Oh my goodness, that took a disgustingly long time to find. Like, the, in the time that I killed the other five, I spent longer than that just trying to find this final one that I needed. <laughs> And we've got the tokens at last. All right, let's go and make this evolution happen. Finally. And just to make matters even more interesting, I have to spawn inside of my base. Ooh, this thing ain't going to fit inside of my base. Uh, <laughs> yep, not at all. Um, okay, sure thing. Nothing a little soul orb can't fix, potentially. There we go. All right, it's time. Let's do this thing at last. Don't know why Ivan, who is currently falling through my base. Are you still up here? You are. Here are your tokens, my friend. Here is everything else you need. And let's click the right one. I don't want to go and click the other, the wrong one. There we go. At last. Here we go. The second of these final tier manticores is about to be mine. Oh my goodness. A lot of work has gone into making this happen. I mean, we did take some shortcuts. Technically, I cloned this Dodo Wyvern, so it's not technically... I didn't breed them both up, but it's fine. It's fine. We spent enough time grinding away at some things that you just got to take the little wins when you get them. And this guy was a little win. Hopefully, he's about to become a big old win. There he goes. All right, here we go. 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 <laughs> oh, please, oh, wicked Wyvern. One, I want this thing to be big. I want it to be powerful. I want it to be strong. I want it to have a lot of health. I want it to be able to kill anything in the game. So I can just go on an absolute slaughter spree of God Mode Dinosaurs. And we can get the Empowerment Level 2 and Empowerment Level 3. And everything else that comes with it. Just give me juiciness, goodness, goldness, godness. I just want it all. Inject it into this world. Come on, Dodo Ivan. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. <laughs> Five. Nope. I'm not even going to start the countdown yet. Because this thing has got a few seconds to go still. It's so hard to time it. I'm going to go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 and a half, 2, 1 and a half, 1, just a half, and it's our little town. Oh my goodness. That is the smallest metagor I think I've ever seen. It's a 0 0.5. Are you kidding me? I don't even have a saddle to ride you on me, buddy. I, I was unprepared. Um. Okay. Okay, that's um that's interesting. Work in progress? Maybe we'll call that. Um, maybe. Uh that's that's not that's not that, that's the opposite. That's the opposite of what I wanted. We've got a 1.9 manticore here. And we've got a 0.5. A little itty bitty point five. That's that's uh that's interesting. Well, it's cool. It's cool. I mean, my dude here may not see the light of day. Oh, let me just let me just leap up here. Um, but it's it's we can clone it. <laughs> I can clone a stronger one if I need to. How strong are we talking here? Ninety six million health. All right. Um, let's let's have a look at your damage and abilities very very quickly. All right. It feels nice to fly around on it because it's so small. Um, it's not quite the like million damage that I was hoping for. Same sort of attacks. It might be just purely aesthetical. The attacks do look very similar. It's got three. That's a different attack. Oh, that's a big old leg. Like... Mm, okay. So yeah, he's got like four attacks, but three of them are kind of showing little explodey bombs. I'm not going to level this guy up. This guy here is, um, he's going to be cloned. And we're going to roll the dice and try and get a bigger one. Basically, I just want the extra damage. That's all there is to it. But hey, buddy, welcome. Welcome, you absolute demon of a dude. Do you have... No, I was going to say, imagine if you had like one extra evolution up your sleeve. That would have been fantastic. But I would be dreaming. Guys, we're going to end this one right here. We finally acquired the Wicked Manticore. And um, yeah, 
yeah, safe to say it's, uh, it's a work in progress. We'll leave it at that. But guys, I'll catch you in the next one tomorrow. Bye for now.